Habit a habit a habit a ball sack. All right, here we go. Super Mario Brothers three mix. Now I'm in this place. I imagine that's going to be lava because it looks like it. So it's going to kill me. Don't want things to kill me. Holy crap, dude! Let's try that again. Yeah. The uh. Falling from vines is a little too easy. But then again, it was kind of kind of easy in the original game as well, so I suppose I can't really complain about that. Um, it's really more of an issue that uh, it's hard to go from one to another without overshooting it and falling off the second one as well. Yay! Okay, um, next. Oh. Ah. Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ha ha! Ah. Hey. Yeah, there's no need for that. I didn't do anything to you at all. And Order 2 decided to just try to chop me right in the dick. Or something. Ah! Yeah, the Mercy Invincibility is a little lax here as well. Um, I'm not sure how many seconds you're supposed to have, but it seems like it's not quite as long as it was in the original game. Maybe I'm just imagining that. It's not really that important. Okay. Can't go down here, right? Oh, let's go down here. See if there is to see down here. So there's something down here to see. Something down here to catch me, so I don't die. I've been doing that a lot lately. What the fart? And there's nothing up here. I don't even know why I was bothering. Probably because it seemed like something to do. Yay! Oh, that's right. This is a, a dungeon. Boss. I never really got into sunshine, so I'm not sure what the boss would be. Piece of crap. This is what I get for waiting, huh? Ugh. All right, let's go. Holy crap, dude! Yeah, shut up. No, 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 no. Well, that's why we have these. Ugh. Sorry about that, I was scratching my nose. So you do this. Mm. Thank you. Boss fight is a little tough. Alright. Let's go this way, I guess. Oh, look, we're going swimming. Yay. Hmm. Whoa, what the hell just happened there? Frame rate's a little better now, so I just started just flip it out on me. <laughs> Look like a special needs kid. Want a football helmet? No, that doesn't mean I was making fun. Just making an observation. That's what I look like. I'm wearing a football helmet. I don't want to go this way. I gotta go underneath. Hmm. I better get in there and get in there. Huh? Yay! And stuff. Oh, 
I'm still figuring this out, you know. Because every single time, you know, you go to a new world, different aesthetics, you know, different map changes, that sort of thing. Aha! Uh -huh. Eat it. Yeah. That's right. And I'll turn you into a block of ice. Yeah, get that too. Yeah. What are you gonna do? The largest arms in the world throw fireballs at you. Wait, no. Ice balls. Yeah. Ice balls. Go away. Yeah. Oh, Mom! The cheap cheap keeps jumping at me, Mom! Holy crap, Mom! I'm getting bombarded, Mom! I'm gonna kick him in the nuts, Mom! Uh oh. Haha! -ha. Look, it fell to its death! And I laughed! Because I'm a sadistic little prick! Okay, anyway. Going up. Yeah. I imagine that does something, but we'll find out what. Go away. Go away. Yeah, that did something. I have no idea what, but we'll just keep right on going because I'll find out one of these days, probably when I come back. Ah, look. I think I'll save state my way through this one, try to get all the items. I need more items, plain and simple. Let's just find out where all the Bowsers are. There's one. Okay. So, this one, this one, this one, and this one. So, as long as we avoid those, we're good. Like I said, I need items, plain and simple. Okay, so the items are few and far between. Which is kind of annoying, simply because, you know, you run out of items, you're screwed. I'm not saying they should come back, necessarily, but, you know, it's, it's real easy to run out of them. You because know, maybe I'm just being careless and using them all. That might be it. It's always something to... I have to actually break this on something. Otherwise, I'm not going to get anywhere. There we go. Ah! There we go. See, I actually, you know, picked a wrong, bad power up to take here. Mm. Yeah. Ah, thank you. No, no, no! One, boing, boing, boing. There's two. Boing, 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 boing. Help. Ugh. Oh man. This is harder than it looks. Ugh. Ah, there we go. Mm. That's harder than it looks. Alright. Okay, let's go back to world five here. Got to finish them all, man. Wait a second. Before we go, I just wanted to be absolutely sure I wasn't missing anything. Okay, now we can go. I just wanted to see what was up here. Oh, cool. Shall we go? Yeah. 
Yeah, buzzy beetles are awesome. You should see more of them. Use more coins. Yeah, I'm to 11 lives now. It's good. A couple tough stages in here, man. That's good. So for all intents and purposes, the thing that I like about this game, I mean, aside from just how you get to have all the uh, Mario games that I loved as a kid all mixed up into one, one package, is that the difficulty isn't ridiculous. And that's one of the things that would absolutely kill this thing for me. Absolutely kill it. There we go. Would be, uh, if for whatever reason, you know, the difficulty is starting to go through the roof. That's one thing that I hate about hacks. I hate that. Absolutely hate that. Because it's something that everybody does. It's stupid. Particularly when you have a game like Contra or Castlevania or Battletoads even, that for whatever reason just isn't you know, hard enough. Let's make it harder to be sadistic about it. Now, if you've got to use save states to get through your get through your hack, man, it, it's just too difficult, and that would ruin this for me. I gotta say, so I'm, I'm hoping that doesn't happen. What I've seen so far, you know, I have to say is fair challenge, and I have no problem with that. What I have a problem with is, you know, stupid stuff, you know, designed to just make things as difficult as humanly possible to the point where it's frustrating. Now, I'm using save states because I want to actually, you know, have a little bit of assistance getting through, particularly when you have things like, you know, running out of items or whatnot. But like I said, it's probably just because I'm reckless and I, I just use an item for every stage when I really shouldn't be doing that anyway. Technically, there is a finite amount of items in the original game anyway, but that's beside the point. The whole point here is, you know, I want to get to the end. You know, I want to see what this uh, place has to offer, all of it. So, I'm going to do what I can do, you know? Automatic scroll water level. Oh, boy. It's like 7-4, man. Or grab, or grab that. There we go. Ice balls. Would you like a frosty drink? Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, but um, as I was saying uh, last video, uh, Gallif Black Mage is playing this as well, and uh, he is. Um, discovering glitches as well. Okay, um, I have one issue here. As the screen bops up and down, uh, Mario's position relative to the Gelectro should likewise correct, but it does not. You know, in other words, he should be bopping up and down the screen because his position really isn't changing. But, uh, you know, just his position on the screen is, that's something completely different. Alright. So if he's just staying in one spot, when the screen goes up and down, he should be moving along with it. That's what I'm saying. Alright, so here we are back in, the um, Sunshine Land. Uh, bang. Yeah! Throw me up there! No, throw me up here! God damn you, piece of shit! Throw me up there! You son of a bitch! Eat... Eat donkey nuts! You crack whore! Or something. Ah, scratch my chin. There we go. Throw me up there! God damn you! Well, f just piss on both of you! I'm going over here! That's probably where my third star coin is. Enjoy. Die a horrible death. Yeah, let's go down here, see if there's a sea. Oh, look. 
one piece of pipe. Hmm. Oh, there's my third star coin. So what the hell is I getting so worked up about? Now I feel kind of dumb. Darp. Okay, let's go up here and see what there is to see up here. There we go. Oh, the end of the stage. Well, we're up to almost two million points, man. Okay, so if I find the alternate exit in here, that'll lead to that pipe, which will take me back to world zero, if I'm not mistaken, and I can get another key, I guess. Um, so yeah, we're gonna stop here, and we'll pick it up next time.